All right, let's take a look at some of these after hours movers. We have four free. We have Twitter, Discover Financial, Qualtrics, and Cadence Design. Let's kick it off with Twitter. Some breaking news here when, within the last just couple of minutes. When asked whether the Biden administration is putting Elon Musk's acquisition of Twitter under national security review, White House Press Secretary Karine Jean-Pierre replying that, quote, we've heard those reportings. Those reportings are not true. We know that Elon Musk has until 5 p.m. Eastern time on Friday to complete his deal to buy Twitter or face a possible trial here. You can see Twitter closing the day up just over 3% over the last three months. If you take a look at that chart, you can see the stock up 29% year to date. We are still in the green up just around 19% trading at 51 52 And we know Musk's deal to buy Twitter was for $44 billion, so we're trading just below that 5420 value. Let's take a look at Discover Financial Services moving to the downside here after hours and earnings miss is what's weighing on the stock. EPS totaling 354 during the quarter. The estimate out there, or at least what the street was looking for, was 377. Discover also saying that provision for credit losses totaled 773 million. The estimate was for 430 million. So it makes you think twice about maybe the slowdown that we will potentially see here in this quarter and then into next year. Taking a look at Discover financial year to date that stock off 17 percent let's take a look at qualtrics international reporting better than expected quarterly results also raising their full year forecast we're seeing that reflected after hours with the stock up just around 11 percent a strong sign here about the willingness of enterprise it to spend at this point year to date it's a totally different story you can see the stock off 70 percent over the past Three months at least. It has performed okay, I guess we can say, at this point as we take a look at the broader market. But over the past three months, Qualtrics off just around 14%. And wrapping it up with Cadence Design Systems, another software play here. That company boosting its full year adjusted EPS forecast, also beating the street's estimates when it comes to earnings. A dollar and six cents, the estimate out there was for 97 cents over the past three months. Better than Qualtrics, off just around a 4.5% year-to-date, taking a look at the performance here, the stock off a 14%.